Hey guys, we know you've had a rough week, so sit down, relax, and enjoy some new pedals at Toman that we're really hyped about. Hey guys, Chris here. And my name is Guillaume. And we are shooting something brand new, something. We're trying out something. Yeah, while something we're... that we usually do, but yeah, never film. <laughs> exactly. Is just try a bunch of pedals. The only new <laughs> thing is about trying new pedals that we're hyped about is that we have cameras on. Yep. So um, <laughs> let us know if you enjoyed this. And uh, we can, of course, do like a sequel, whatever, make it a series. Let's call it Pedal Something. Therapy, <laughs> that's good. Pedal Therapy. Okay. Yeah, so uh, we have selected two brand new brands that um, you can get at Toman, and we are super yep. interested in uh, checking them out. So uh, let's get into it. All right, so the first brand is Surfy Industries, they're, because they're obvious, they're yeah. really big units. Yeah, yeah. And they are reverb tanks, among other things, because we're also going to play some stomp boxes that we have there. Which one is one, it? One, the Surfy Tramp. Surfy Tramp. Yeah, so, uh, well, the name says it all, basically. It's a, a brand that focuses on surfy kind of sounds. But not only, like I'm not the biggest surf music fan. I, you know, like it, but yeah, it's yeah. not like my thing. But the reverbs are just crazy good, actual spring reverbs. And they have some tram and uh, like a blackface type boost, boost uh, pedal and a vibe. Well. So like really nice, cool, old school effects. Yeah, yeah, blackface or brown face, sort of modded circuits and, uh, and they work really, really well for sure. And the other brand is Honeybee Amps. It's brand new for Tuman, for sure. It's a really small brand um, from Hungary, and uh, they, yeah. Chris is proud. Yeah. I'm Sorry. Proud. Actually <laughs> proud. Yeah, of course. <laughs> and uh, we have a couple of new pedals from this brand: uh, the Double Trouble, which is a two-side overdrive, more mid rangey yeah. and a more clean-sounding overdrive. I was gonna say just like. Subtly SRV inspired, but Subtly. one side is just like SRV land, so I guess, yeah. Well, okay. it's pretty, pretty that's, obvious. That's yeah, my so jam. I'll get the strat. A, it's a, a clean drive and a, a tube screamery kind of sound, and there's a, a fuzz called Dolly Dagger. You guess what kind of fuzz circuit that's supposed to be? Yeah, so uh, it's a Germanian fuzz, and uh, we'll mix these pedals and have some fun. The amp is, by the way, Totally dry, it's the Magnetone, uh, stereo, panoramic, whatever it's, it's called. It's just such a shame to use it dry, but yeah. whatever. <laughs> For the sake let's of just, trying out pedals. Let's just not use its awesome tram and everything. This is just the amp. And then, that's the clean drive. And then the Surfy Bear. Does it drip? It does. I'm really sorry for my very, very poor surf kind of thing. This is so cool. But it's such a cool pedal. So, uh, yeah, whatever. Um, let's uh, turn on the tram.
Test. What is going Never on? Never heard that in reggae ever. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not enough but chill. I'm glad. I'm, I'm glad. We got Surfy Chris today. We got Reggae Chris. We're in for a treat. Just gonna, <laughs> gonna try some different things. I'm really excited. Okay, um, let's uh, treat Guillaume for a sec. Wait. Yes. There you go. It sounds oh, so man. good though. And this it was does both. the thing. This was both, yeah. Hey, I broke my arm. <laughs> right now? <laughs> Still hurts. It's such okay, a cool sound enough. though. It's so... Well, it's that, that was the blackface? Yeah, yeah. yeah. Nice. I swapped over to the blackface to have more of that, you know, Actual the blackface kind of... Bias, uh, tremolo, yeah. and... Uh, yeah. I mean, I can uh, turn on the intensity. I'm gonna start surf music. It's so fun to play. <laughs> <laughs> Let's connect the other one. The surfy bear. This is 
their biggest spring reverb, and uh, you can actually get it into shapes and forms. Yeah, this one is the floor the unit. Metal enclosure yeah, with uh, the actual on foot switch. switch. Yeah. And you can still connect like a, a foot switch to it in case you don't want to have it in front of you because it does this. It's pretty good, man. I mean, I don't uh, want to. That, that, you know, that was a little bit, wait. but. Wow. Okay, that's a testament to you can have that on your board and stomp on it and not have the crazy tank shaking noise wow. madness. Can you even do it? Ah, the trick is on the side. But on the top. Right? That's so cool. <laughs> <laughs> Normally, you drop a pin on it, like a pin needle. And it's all over the it's place. It's like, yeah. But if you don't want to have it on the floor, you also have the pretty option. Is that, is that what they do, like the telemarketing? <laughs> yeah, <laughs> RTL pretty or something. accurate. Yeah. I, f I feel weird already, so you're, you're spot on. Man. It will cut and dice your vegetables as well. <laughs> <laughs> this one goes on your amp, and uh, you can turn it on and off with the foot switch on the side, and that's pretty much it. What's interesting is that it doesn't have the volume option. There's just tone mix and dwell. It's just like, put it there, put it in your effects. Uh, yeah. uh, I, I mean, I would leave that on all the time. Would not set it for a crazy setting maybe, but just, and I mean, just leave it on. If right? you already have a magnetone on. Yeah, it's almost the same. I mean, how, it's just a bit how brighter. Good, how good does that? <laughs> I will start with the Surfy Bear without anything on, and then I'll just kick on the fuzz, the overdrive, whatever feels right. So subtle, but like so. Exactly. To me, that's the that's the one trait of a really good uh, like spring reverb. It's gonna sound massive, but not be in your way. Whatever you no. play, it's not artificial in any way. And that's I think what's really hard to emulate in pedals. Yeah. I mean, some pedals do that fantastic, of course, but yeah, it's just so hard to get it right because the little springs will move around in a different manner, little depending springs. on. That's so so cute. cute. Springs Depending are moving on around. Your, um, your attack, the yeah. string, the amount of distortion going in, whatever. So it's, it's just unique every single time you hit. I mean, it's a reverb overkill right now, but I also want to hear what's going on in the band. I would probably use less of it. I wouldn't. He wouldn't. <laughs> All right, some gain fun. Whatever. <laughs> More fuzz. It did the Germanium thing, Sorry. like it did, it no. collapsed onto itself and then just like bloomed back up. <laughs> oh my god! So that was pedal therapy. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that, exactly. You guys should definitely let us know if you enjoy that, if, uh, well, these pedals in particular, obviously, and some others that you'd like to see on here. Oh yeah. And you'd like there, to hear us play. Of course, tons of smaller brands, you know, not the obvious ones. We don't only want to show like the main A brands and whatever. Yeah. If you guys are interested in anything that's a little more unique or just brand new at home on and you've never heard it, let us know. Maybe it's, um, it's doable. We have it in stock and then we can shoot a video on it. Yeah. You guys take it easy. I hope you enjoyed this one. Also, do not forget to like that video if you liked it. If you disliked it, just 
don't do anything. <laughs> and uh, don't forget to subscribe and hit the bell, and we'll see you guys very, very soon. Take care and uh, peace. Bye-bye.